first night in Terraria when you have just a small wooden kind of crappy looking little box and you just have to hold your own against zombies and demonize for the first time while you slowly poop yourself. Hey what's up guys, Trex here and welcome back to another episode of Terraria 1.3 with JXW. This episode we are in the underground jungle because I will show you when we get there. But that's just a quick little hint. So, um, we have some stuff to grab, and the reason we are in the jungle is because I was exploring the underground jungle, trying to find some awesome stuff, and I did find some very, very awesome stuff, which we will get to. So, I'm just gonna make sure I have everything. Uh, grenades, I need grenades. There we go. And I believe that is it. Although we might want to use this. I think we will use this somehow. So, in case you haven't already guessed, hey, 200 zombie. We're in the underground jungle because I found a little hive while I was exploring. So we're going to head to our little entrance right now should be coming up just across the horizon in just a second oh almost almost nailed that that would have been a pretty cool analogy jump okay here we go there's the entrance to the underground jungle I built my little jungle hut on the wrong entrance which is kind of embarrassing but oh well so I, I came down here oh ooh, 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 tree frog tree frog yes yes I got a frog so I came down here to this giant, giant chasm. Uh, it's kind of like a giant central chasm, I sort of think. Yeah, it, it's massive. And I was firing my gun, and it bounced off and started lighting up my world and stuff. So I, I saw over here, we had just barely touched it, but we hadn't fully explored it. So over here that there was a nice little cabin. So I ran through this cabin, got some statues, some paintings, a chest, pretty sweet. And then over here to the right, we have one of these jungle shrines. And then I got myself the staff, staff of regrowth or whatever, come over here, got another one. So I start digging around, see what I can find. I'm digging around, I'm digging around. I, I had a danger sense potion. I saw some stuff up here, some sparkling stuff. Got up here, I remembered it was cobwebs. But over here, I saw this honey block sort of glistening. And then I was like, whoa, what's that? So I started digging down. Look what I found. Found a nice, sweet hive. So all we have to do is just put the last few platforms in. And then we will be all good to fight the queen bee. Just like Lordy, or however you pronounce her name, I really don't care. So, just put in these last few platforms, that should be good enough. Hopefully, hopefully, I hope. Eh, it should be close enough. Yeah, there we go. Now, don't have any blocks to block herself off, so I'm just going to grab a couple. And then, we are going to get to it. So let's just block this right here come on come on come on there we go okay okay there we go uh stupid little jungle bat get out of here all right let's wait till we have full health we're going to set up our load up in the meantime got ourselves some nice potions and some grenades i don't want that i don't want that i want this second this third uh grenades fourth harpoon demon scythe ha yo yo harpoon and that's how the layout is going to be. So, <sighs> Queen Bee. I, I, Skeletron has been ticking me off a ton. I, I really need some, I really need to get some confidence. So I really, really need to beat this, this boss. I don't think it'll be too hard though, because Queen Bee still a fairly early game boss. But we'll see, because. I thought Skeletron couldn't possibly as hard as people on Reddit were saying, but look how wrong I was. So we're just going to wait for the last 20 health, the last 20 health, 
and then we'll get started, and then we'll end off the episode, because it is 10.05, and I've still got stuff I'm trying to do, and I'm going to play some Terraria offline sometime, and uh, we'll have even more progress for the next episode, but we're at 400 health, I think it's time to do this, let's see if we can trick shot it, oh! First try, Queen, oh, oh, there she is, okay, Queen B has awoken, so I, I, I got a whole bunch of meteorite shot, because I was running low, so I'm just going to keep a stream of this going, uh, until she starts circling us, there she goes, alright, oh, we should buff, yeah, there we go, now we can see her, alright, and now we're going to go to the laser gun, or space gun, or whatever it's called, because it is love this weapon. I, I'm still using this weapon. It's like one of the earliest weapons you can get. Ooh, we can see her. We can sort of predict her attack patterns, kind of. Possibly, because we can... Oh, snap! Get away from that. Can I hit her? Hit her? Hit her, please? Hit her? That'd be nice. You know, that, that'd be pretty nice. Didn't, didn't set up my accessories, I realize now. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's not too fun. Hi, right, Queen B. We are going to. Where's where is she? Oh, she's finding stingers. Okay. I wonder what sort of weapons we can get. Stop hitting me with your stingers, woman. Queen B. You can call me Queen B. And baby, I'll choose a nice green herbal tea. All right, we're gonna demon side this up because that should get us a whole bunch of hits against her. Oh yes. Oh, there we go. That is doing wonders oh man okay that is excellent oh gosh okay I need to heal up in 15 seconds because I am poisoned so I just need to dodge around until then should be too difficult oh man oh get away from me you stupid bees heal 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 oh perfect nailed it okay um just gonna keep the demon side thing going until we hit her a couple times. Oh gosh. Okay. She's down to like half ish health. Okay, come on, Trix. You can dodge her. Come on, dodge her. There we go. Alright, here she goes again. And for the attack. Oh gosh. These stupid bees are annoying the heck out of me. Because they are taking my health down so much. Oh, oh, dang it. Stand in the honey. Stand in the honey. Stand in the honey. Oh, dodge. Oh, sick dodge, bro. Oh, that was close. That was a bit too close, actually. Okay. Get out of here, mini map. Okay, 10 seconds. Gotta make it 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Stand in the honey. Stand. Nope, not gonna happen. Nope, yep. Nope, dang it. Okay, Queen Bee might be a bit harder than I thought. But, I think we can make an abomination or something. Um, yeah, I just need to get a bottle somehow, and that might be a bit tough. Do I have any bottles on me? Dang it, I... Come on, I just need one bottle. How do I not have a bottle? Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I've got an idea. We're gonna run to the desert real quick. We're gonna grab some sand. We're gonna do some super cool stuff. We're going to make ourselves a nice stove. I have the stone, which I don't. So I'm going to need to grab that, grab the torches. Should be a desert nearby, I believe. Um, so we're going to do that. We're going to grab the glass to make some bottles. Yes, yes, yes. Thank goodness. We are right by the desert. Okay, okay. So just grab this. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, okay, now we have the snow need. Now let's grab some sand real quick. Alright, we're going to regenerate health. And this time we're going to dodge those stupid bees and use the demon side more, because that is quite an effective weapon. Then we're going we're gonna to set up our accessories problem. Dang it, we won't have as many buffs. So that will be difficult. No, I want that spawn point set. Okay, okay, here's what we're going to do. Now, we're going to craft ourselves stove, or furnace I mean. And we're going to set this over here. Then we're going to craft some glass. Alright, got three glass. Stop killing me, slimes. Then we're going to make ourselves some bottles. How do I make bottles? How do I make bottles? Oh no, please don't say I need an anvil or something. 
There are so many slam slimes. Okay, royal gel. I need to equip that. Uh, okay. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, here's how I make the bottles. So I'm just going to make those. Then we're going to get some bottled honey. Then we're going to go and... Uh, we don't have all... We have a shine potion. We don't have any other potions. So we're going to have to be extra good. We're going to have to have the uh, warding buffs and stuff. But I think we'll be able to do that. Um, Feral Claws, I could use those somehow. But I, I really just want to beat her. Because she should be fairly easy. And if I can't beat Queen Bee, then I'm going to quit YouTube forever. I'm just kidding. Uh, traveling Merchant has arrived. It is like midday, dude. Step up your game. Come on, man. You, you, you gotta... You gotta have to want it if you're gonna be a traveling merchant you're gonna have to have a you're gonna have to arrive in the morning not at not at 1 p.m. when you only have six hours left for me to buy your goods I, I I'm gonna need more time into that seriously come on what was your name Almron or something I I don't care so I've lost my respect for you Almron go, go back to working IT or whatever I just Get out of my world. I already have my fez. I don't need anything else. You're showing up halfway through the workday. You know where I, my NPCs are all night? They're in their holes. They're not allowed to come out. They're always up. They're always working. And you just think you can frolic in here and just show up? Be like, hey, you want to buy some stuff? Super cool stuff? No. I don't think so. Because, Almiron, or whatever your name is, you are lazy. Uh huh. You're lazy. Just like your father, McFly. Poison dart. Can I just throw these? No. Dang it. Ah, okay. Oh, I got a magnet stone. That will be really useful. I just need more accessories. Warning Shield of Cthulhu. I'm going to need that. I need those. Um, I'm going to need that. I'm not going to need that. So I'm going to equip the magma stone there and the royal gel. Or the feral claws. Or the regeneration band. Hmm. Nope. Can't. Nope. Nope. I'm just going to use the, uh, warding royal gel because it gives us the defense that we need. So, now nah, I'll, just, I'll just do Feral Claws, because that gives plus 3% damage and some melee speed. So, that should be pretty useful. And this is just going to set enemies on fire. Uh, even though our sword already does that, this will also be helpful. So, how do we make an abomination? We need honey in a bottle. That's what it was. Yeah. Can I not get the honey or something? It's not, not count as honey. Oh, okay, there we go. This counts as honey. So, now I've got a nice little healing pod that I forgot about. So I'm going to create some bottle honey. And there we go. Abomination. Am I ready? Accessories are ready. We don't have the buffs. But oh well. So, okay. Queen Bee. Here we go. Where is she? I kind of know her attack pattern. Nope. Okay. Yeah, okay. I I've got it figured out. We're just going to keep this stream of bullets going. Until we can demon side it. So... And demon size should get rid of the bees. We're gonna stand in this honey. We're gonna stand in the honey when we have to demon size and stuff. And then we're gonna try and use this. I can sort of see her over there. When she's on fire, I can see her. So that's good. We're gonna try and spread out this demon side as much as possible. We're gonna get down into the honey. We're gonna heal up. Alright, so out of mana points. So just gonna get rid of these bees. Bees are really annoying, seriously. They, they, they're they just awful. Alright, got mana. Oh, I could have dodged that one, and I didn't. So, this is going to get some hits on her. Some serious hits, yo. Okay, and get out of there, because she is stinging. She's stinging like a bee, if you will. Oh, that was bad. That was real bad. Oh, get away from that. Nailed it. 
Stand where the abomination was. Or, I mean, the larva. That's what it's called. Nice hit. Nice hit. And out of grenades. Okay. Get to the honey. And we're going to just keep healing up as much as possible. We just need to keep as much life as possible. And dodge. Oh, yes. Totally timed that right. And dodge. Nope, nope, nope. That was bad. That was really bad. Come on. There's now just a blank space. But we are at 256 health, so that is, oh, that's all right, that's all right. But I need to keep dodging those darts, because I am getting seriously poisoned, and that is really annoying. I wish I could see them, but they are super difficult to see. So, all right, keep going while she dodges. There we go, now keep these demon scythes going. Oh, okay, perfect. She is right it's on top of us, but, but, but... Butts, butts, look at this. Oh man, oh, oh man. If we can just keep this up. Oh wow, oh wow. She is down to 1200 health now. Jump, get that. Oh no, no, we're in such good position to get her. We were about to win this fight. Oh, pick up that health, pick up that health. We can still heal up in three seconds though. We are going to win this fight. I am determined, I am determined to heal up, heal up already, get in the honey, you stupid incompetent player, alright, and hotkeys, going all MLG on this, boom, oh, the demon side is such an effective weapon against her, why haven't I been using this more, get those mana stars and those hearts while we're at it, oh man, she is getting kinda, kinda pissed, but, yeah, she she knows that the fight is lost. She has nothing to live for because she is down for the... Oh, okay, good. She's down for the count. Sting Operation Achievement Unlocked. Whoo! Wow, treasure bag. All right. Let's see what goodies we got. I honestly don't know what the Queen Bee has. Yeah, spiked hive pack. Huh? No, get that back. Increases the strength of friendly bees. Hive wand. Consumes hive and places hives. Ah! Ah! So now... Yep. I don't know what that does. But okay. That's cool, I guess. Consumes hive and places hives. All right. Uh, we've been going for enough time, but we need to look up what this does, because it seems kind of pointless. Which or not? Okay, hive. What? Hi oh, okay. Can I not? Where's my hive block? Okay, you can't place hive block. So this allows you to place the hive block. We've got the bee hat. Kind of looks like the uh, Pittsburgh Steelers store. Right? Got bee nades and some bee wax and some bottle honey. As well as, oh my gosh, 26 gold? Wowza. Wowza, not trouser. But, but most of all, we beat the. Ah! Ah! Witch Doctor! Ah! Oh, the fountains cost money now? Dang it. Used to be able to buy infant. Oops. But, oh, yes. Oh, Witch Doctor. We got everything we need. Let's make it a hallowed water fountain, even though there's no heart. Oh, oh that's so cool. I never, I never messed with those water fountains in the last Let's Play. I need some more, but I don't have the monies, I don't think. I want the pure water. Yes, I want jungle water. I want icy water. I want desert water. I want corrupt water, crimson water, and blood water fountain. There we go. We still have 22 golden savings because I got two coin portals earlier. But anyways, guys, that was a very successful episode of Terraria. Li uh, not living underground. Terraria 1.3. Let's play with T Rex C W. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Oops, spawn point removed. Goodbye.